Hello everyone, Mary here from Ireland again with our weekly reading for February the 19th. And February the 19th is my oldest son's birthday. He doesn't watch my videos as far as I know. He'll be 33 and uh, yeah, they weren't long going those 33 years. So here we go with our reading and I have one, two, three, four, five decks of cards that I've been using for choosing cards for friends and clients and uh, we'll see what we get. Um, I know the energies around this solstice, um, I did the daily videos and it was go, 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 but myself, I'm not there yet. I'm seeing people posting on Facebook about being spaced out and that's kind of how I felt. Uh, need to ground ourselves, need to drink more wa all our water, um, sleep when we need it and just go with the flow, I suppose. I'm tired, like I've been sleeping, I'm tired, I'm dreaming at night. Um, not my usual, usual type of dreams, so I'm not making much sense of them as of yet. And they kind of come in and then I forget what they were even though I remember, but then they're gone quickly. It's not like the vivid, vivid dreams where I get huge guidance, like a meditation. So here we go. We will start with my new deck, the Ascended Masters deck. We'll choose one, see if we need another, and uh, we'll go through the few decks I have around me, if needs be. Meditate. Quiet time, meditate, go within, find your answers, find your quiet time and uh, your answers. But I think it is more about quiet time. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, I have something to tell you. Uh, remember last week I said I needed some sunshine. Well, a beautiful client of mine who still watches my videos uh, sent me an email and invited me over to sunny Spain. <laughs> I was in awe and overwhelmed and um, full of gratitude. So I'm working on that. Um, flights aren't that readily available. They kind of go once a week to this particular region and uh, I'm looking at that, sorting it out, weaving in and out between commitments I have in my diary already. So I will let you know when I'm going. Now it might, maybe soon, I want it to be just that day. I was going to drop all and go, but um, I have a full day um, event tomorrow, the 17th, with um, clients, so uh, I've got to, you know, be calm, research it, know that I'm going, but I don't know when. And that could be a message for you. A lot of people um, that I'm hearing to feel a bit stuck and don't know where they're going. And um, now I don't feel stuck myself, but I know I'm moving forward. And in the physical, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going to be living. I don't know where, where I'm going basically but uh, it'll all come to us and just trust and believe and calm and the quiet time the quiet time so a quiet inner week it seems starting off anyway yes so the answer to your question is yes yes you trust your intuition yes you're going to receive your answers in your quiet time yes you're going to receive your guidance in your quiet time if you've been looking for an answer, should I do this, should I not, should I, should I, should I, should I, should I, the answer is yes, go for it. Like the videos during the week, it's time, you've been thinking about it long enough, yes, go for it. Bring that yes into your inner being and then you will feel, just like my trip to Spain, I will feel when it's the right time to go and then it'll just all fall into place easily with ease 
these are great cards, aren't they? That's Ganesh, and the other man was a Buddha, Siddhar. Siddhar, I know that's a great Indian name. Meditate. One more from this deck. Purification, white Tara, she's coming up a lot as well. So your physical body, keeping it clean. Your outer body, I mean your inner body, your digestive system, what you take into your system, drinking more water, bathing, sea salt baths, keeping your energy clean, keeping your physical body free of toxins, keeping your energy clean. Be careful who you let into your space. Take this quiet time for yourself every day. Connect with your higher self and um, bring the love in. And that's what you will attract. So keeping your space clear. If there are people pulling at your energy, you've got to let them go with love. Let them go with love. Okay. White Tara. I don't have the book handy, but if you want to look up White Tara, um, Google and see what else we need to know about her. Now, the John Holland Psychic Tarot for the Heart deck. What we need to know. What we need to know or focus on or the energy of the week either. What's, it could be a little, these are tarot, so there could be a little future stuff in it. So we'll see. Let me just, there's one in here. Nurture. Same message, same message. Nurturing week, meditating, quiet time, inner Mind in yourself, mind in your energy. Don't be at everybody's beck and call. Look after you. Your physical body needs um, nurturing as well because the energies are changing and DNA. I don't 100% understand it, but our bodies are changing. Our bodies need nurturing. Our bodies need water. I keep picking the water card. Drink more water, drink more water. And um, they're saying to, and I know this from years back from a man that I used to go and listen to, um, you need the salt with the water as well. Just a tad of Himalayan salt or sea salt or, you know, because they complement each other, we put it that way. So nurture yourself and we have sunshine and light. So look after yourself and uh, take your quiet time. Take your time to yourself every day so that you are keeping your own energies up. You know, you cannot be running here, there and everywhere, looking after everybody else if you're depleting your energy by doing so. Number three. We choose one more from that deck. And I'm not sure whether we need any more after that or not. Same message. Interesting, isn't it? Manifest. So as you take good care of yourself, you're manifesting your dreams and your desires and you're bringing them on earth. So inner work ascends you and you're drawn in everything that's good for you. Okay, great guidance there this week. Um, now, what else, what will I go for? I'll take one from the daily guidance from your angel stack and that'll be it because the messages are all the same so nurture yourself look after yourself mind your energy take your quiet time every day do something to nurture yourself and bring yourself to a place of calm and you will be manifesting your dreams unknown to yourself your energy it's what your energy feels like that brings in what you need Ooh, okay I'm not going to use this as the card but energy work <laughs> um, this one is popping here ground yourself yeah 
So bringing it all to earth. Meditate was the first card. Ground yourself is the next card. When you detach from awareness of your body and the physical world, you become ungrounded. Although it's pleasant to float heavenward, your attention and work are needed upon the earth. We're helping you balance the spiritual and material so that you can enjoy a fulfilling earthly life. So that's what this week is about. Since the first card was meditate, nurture yourself, nurture your body, keep your energy clear. You're grounding everything that you ha you're bringing in, you're grounding it onto earth. The last sentence is the important one. We're helping you balance the spiritual and material so that you can enjoy a fulfilling earthly life. So that's what this week is about. Enjoy it. Take the guidance and see the manifestation of your dreams and your desires. And enjoy. Enjoy your quiet time and enjoy. Don't make it a hard week. Make it a nurturing week. And you'll see as the days go on the benefits of that for you. And grounding yourself, of course, out in nature as well, hugging the trees, walking in nature, bringing nature in, eating nature, bringing nature into your house, etc., etc. So love and light to you. Have a great, great week. And I'm here for readings by email, by phone, by Skype. Kind of, maybe, dear, I have to try the connection again. I'm not sure how good it is um, because the internet seems to be waning here. Um, that's time to go it is time to go from here but I don't know where I'm going so love and light to you I'm available my website is below and you'll find all my social media buttons on my website you'll find pictures of Ireland you'll find information you'll find blogs a lot of stuff on the internet if you have time to browse uh, on my website if you have time to browse and go through you'll find interesting bits and pieces so love and light to you we'll talk to you during the week maybe we'll see what the guidance is so love and light to you bye bye now